welcome back to the cabin. That's camera. what I say. Welcome back. Say that. You could go, welcome back to the caravan Addis and I'll go, bonjour. Oh, well, welcome back to the caravan Addis. Um, we seem to think the eating's sorted itself out, haven't we? Well, it's too There's bad. only five now, I split it, but like I say, I'm, Paul's ringing me tomorrow from Stuart Longton, but um, anyway, before we know everybody watches the beginning of the video, hopefully, uh, just want to update you on Tour Fest Northwest. Uh, it's for a start off, it's not the Tony Addy show. Right, it's Tour Fest Northwest with the Caravan Note from the Caravan Addis. Uh, we originally said, can you bring some food as a buffet, didn't we? Uh, but we've changed our mind, so you don't need to bring any food. Uh, and the reason being is, there's a permanent, every Friday, uh, pizza van. You've seen the pizzas on our videos in the past, haven't they? Uh, so, we don't want you to bring no food. If you're hungry, just go and get a pizza. You can take the pizza in the club. As a matter of fact, I'll go and show you this and then I'll come back. Okay. I'll go and show them the pizza up now. Yeah. Yeah. Right, and then I'll come back. Pick your tea up while you're there. Pick your tea up while you're there. Alright, so we'll see you in a bit. Welcome. Bye. See you in a bit. I said I'd come here, didn't I? So that's the club where we're having the meet up on the 24th. Uh, like we just said, we did ask you to bring some food with you. Uh, we pay for the club, we'll pay for the DJ. But you don't need to bring any food, do you? Because Luke, this is here on site every Friday. Uh, you've seen these on other videos in the past, haven't they? So if you're running a bit late and you want to come here for some food, just come and get your food from here. See these guys. The last order's uh, 20 to 8. So uh, if you're going to get here at half 6, 7 o'clock, you're not time to get your food, come here. And get your pizzas first, don't you? And then head your way in there. You can take pizzas in there as well. Right, so I said I'd show you. Right. Thank you very much. Morning. Saturday morning. Morning, sweetie pie. Morning. Oh, you're looking very nice this morning, as usual. Every morning. I don't know why I've said that, to be quite honest. You were say that 15 minutes ago. No. Um, right, I have... You know, actually, on that note, I remember the first time your dad ever met me. You went to the kitchen and went to him. She doesn't usually leave that room. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. You went to because she's not been up long. As your dad met you. When you lived on Sandy Lake. That's what he said about his future life. I don't remember it. It's a long time ago. Yeah. Anyway, um, I've convinced myself I am really thick because well, you don't need to agree with me. For a simple reason is, two weeks ago uh, we was in tent belting services and I said, don't forget about the merch wins. And we're still going to put this up. Don't we? Because last night I was this morning, quarter to four in here. These decided to come away from the caravan. The wind is bad here. So I've been spragging, what well, not spragging, what do you call it? Tensioning the poles up. Uh, so I've not been asleep yet. So I did, did, did you hear the wind, Deb? <laughs> when I lied on me. Good here. Good here, couldn't hear nothing. Alright. So no. But I need to get up at you got up at twenty past three and under the can of coke. It's coke zero. Coke zero, yeah no. Twenty that, past three. I'm dead dry. But uh yeah, so as you can see with this all this strong wind, the skirt has never moved. So we're doing a fantastic job at looking at it, it's still windy as anything now. Errol, we've had a visit from uh, the Swift Owners Club, the rear on uh, Donkey Creek. Uh, look at all the benefits you get there if you join it. Uh, feel free to pause and read it. Uh, oh, oh, oh. I know, and that's how you join it there. So, because I was busy, I said, can we come round in a bit? So we've got to go round in a bit and have a chat with them. Uh, it's full of elegances on here, isn't it? It was yesterday. When it was we yesterday, so we'll go and look yeah. at some elegances and stuff like that. Uh, we've also got this. Yeah, you you hold it. Be a, be a model. We've been so beautiful. Let me just show you where it is. Now we watched a video of Dan Trudgeons, didn't we? All right, Dad, don't get carried away. We watched the video. Pass it here a minute. We watched the video of Dan Trudgeon put it on, and he swears by this, don't he? Yeah, there's no scratches as such. It's where Tony's gone at that like a bull in a china shop cleaning windows. You know what? It's anything. What's not my fault? Have I cleaned them windows? No. Did you use something on it? What? Oh, I use that uh, brush, didn't I? Yeah. 
So it's so like, that her line scratches on the. Yeah, they're like, yeah, see, apologise for saying that. You don't need to apologise. No, I'm on about you because you said. Nah, nah, nah. Right. We used a brush on it, so they're like, the faint scratches out. They await sunshine because we're in sun, believe it or not, here all the time. That's when you remember her, Anthony bought me that <coughs> microfiber yeah. brush, didn't I? So yeah, I put her line scratches on it. So that's we'll, supposed to get them out. Isn't that's it? supposed to get it out. So we'll give, I'll give that a go. Um, but I'm going to remove these now. I know. I'm going to remove these because what I think, look, watch. What? Now that's, they're still moving on it, ground, are they? So I think that's been blown forward and it's pulled them off there. So at quarter to four this morning, <laughs> I was up putting it, spraying it back in. Right, so if you want to get in contact with Swift Owners Group, like I said, that's what you do. They have rallies. They've been here quite a few times, haven't they, Deb? Yeah. Um, so we're going to have a, we're going, hey. And we're going seeing the Perk entrance because it's new caravan day. Yeah. Well, it was new yesterday. They picked it up yesterday and they come straight in, didn't they? Yeah, that all looks too hot in there. Oh, it is hot. Oh, that looks hot as a window. You've got eating on like a psychopath. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. So we'll leave it there. I'll get this uh, sprag down. Uh, then we'll go and see Pilkies and then I'll do the window. And I'm supposed to be on a break. And there's some cooking. Yes. And what are you cooking? I'm cooking some. We don't know, her con. Yeah, I can't breathe. Garlic, garlic chicken, garlic and lemon chicken. In, why does it not work though? Oh, there it is. In the slow cooker. Right, okay then. Oh, oh look at your hair blowing there. Heaven, that. Right, okay. It's seven. Right, so we'll leave it there, shall we, sweetie pie? And uh, I'll carry on with this work I'm doing. Look, I can feel that here actually. How is it coming out here? See you in a bit. Bye. Bye. Right, that's all I can do really. So I'm hoping there's a better idea. Is that how all, all on is look? Because it it'll do its job. The solid, the solid now, because they're actually in the ground, aren't they? So how are you going, sweetie pie? Hey. Sorry if you can hear some noise. It's the work on again. Just give her a special shout out, um, and she's got to be surprised, I believe so. Ain't she? And you're surprised as well. Yeah, I'm always surprised. Uh, Chelsea, Shuck, and Leo, your boyfriend. No, you didn't expect that coming, did you? So, Chelsea, Shuck, and Liam, your fantastic boyfriend, new subscribers, thank you very much for watching the Caravan Yep. Alright, that was off. I think it's your dad, Graham. But it's definitely off your granddad, Graham. Isn't it? There's a lot of Grahams in that shop family. Yeah, isn't I know. Right. They're all nutcases. No, there's only Ste <laughs> Stephen. The oh, yeah, he's a nutcase. Right. Stephen, shop, Graham, no. All the shops. Knock, knock. Shock, yeah, shop, S H U, and whatever it is. But Chelsea and Liam, thanks for watching the Caravan Addies. Right, come on, we're going. See you in a bit. Okay. Right, we just got back from Morrison's. Come with Sweetie Pie. She's just been and bought some ingredients. Um, would you like to tell everybody what you're making today for tea? Uh, garlic and lemon chicken in the slow cooker. Have you got a lemon? Well, all the camera. <laughs> you're very funny, you do. Have you got a lemon? I've not seen a lemon. What's this? All right. It's good, that, actually. Yeah. <laughs> one all the camera. So what do you have to do? Uh, there's 50 grams of butter. All you're doing is you just browning your chicken before you put it in slow cooker so you just brown both sides so you put 50 grams of butter in a frying pan in a frying pan and then coat your chicken in some flour so it's coating it yeah yeah okay try not to touch it but you're not going to get all that in there though are you yeah well Oops. Uh, what was that? No room in caravans. That's why we've got an awning. Oh, but you can't. What? You can get the awning, can you? It's dead. What? what are you doing? Who cleans the sh? I yeah, know that. Stuff up. Right, so you just uh, cover this in. Cover this? 
right, and your caravan in flour. If you mm. don't cover your caravan, then you're not cooking. Right, and then just let that brown off in the... And then get about a shake. Because you don't need that. Right, okay. Right, you carry on talking because right. I'm going to be busy for a minute. Okay. What I didn't mention before is... Um, well, we've just met uh, Nigel. Is it Broster? Brosner? Broster. Broster. Nigel in Morrison's, uh, and we talked about Tourfest. And while we're on about Tourfest, is there's been two cancellations. And the sweetie pie. We've had um, a guy called Mike making stoke. He messaged me Thursday morning. He's picked a letter up, what's what posted, and he asked to have a major, not a major. He's having an operation. He's having an operation on his, well, somewhere in his neck, it's bad. So. I hope everything's all right, Mike, and uh, Julia will look after you, provided her knee's okay. And um, so he can't come, so he's had to cancel that one. And then um, Gemma, is it? Gemma, yeah. Gemma, um, what's happened to Gemma? Well, or can you not say? <laughs> uh, yeah, the caravan's unhitched. And the caravan's unhitched. Took off and it's an electrical van, wasn't it? Something like that. So they've managed to get back to a seasonal pitch, but it's not. Um, not horrible. Not horrible. So she's gutted as well, Gemma. So I hope you get all that sorted out. And uh, we have a, a, a link, a video somewhere, which shows you how to hook up to a caravan. <laughs> right, okay. Done it. No, I'm, I'm only joking. But I hope everything's okay. So what I'm trying to say is there's two pictures available. As you all know, the site sold out again. Uh, so if, you, if you've missed out and you want these two pictures, give Donkey Creek a ring tomorrow, which will be Monday, because you're watching this on Sunday, aren't you? Right, so that's that. Um, right, where are we up to? I don't know what I'm doing. Right, I've just put 100 grams in my slow cooker. That's all. Right. Oh, only another 100 grams of butter? Yeah. Right, okay then. And then you put two slices of lemon. Make sure you take the... Peeling off? No. You know? Pips. Alright, okay. And then it's four cloves of garlic which is that isn't it is that garlic what that little white thing yeah right okay then do you know what? i've just sat by i've got a garlic press at home four pound fifty for that first said 12 quid did it sure as how much you don't listen to me oh i didn't pay for it right, just like that brian so if you want to come back in a bit when i'm ready for putting it in all right then see you in a bit you're a creep you see you in a bit you're a creep. Bye. bye goodbye from this lemon Goodbye from this lemon. I'll put a little bit of lemon on there actually. Ooh. Okay, we'll come back to you when it's getting prepared. See you in a bit. Right, she so started putting everything in. <clears throat> so you've got your garlic, your lemon, and your butter in there, is that it? I've got 100 grams of butter, two slices of lemon, four garlic cloves, and then it says 100 ml of chicken stock. So you just bang it all in. Add your chicken. So is that, is that enough browning, yeah? Oh, yeah. Because <clears throat> it's got cooks three to four hours on eye. Or if you want to cook it all day, you can... Put it on low. Put it on low, yeah. I man. I like my lemon. All right. I do like my lemon, me. Squeeze some lemon on it. Add me... Chicken stock, and then leave it. Three to four hours in slow cooker. Will that chicken come out like that, or will they all break up? No, it'll come out like that. Right. There's not a lot of liquid in there, then. You, your butter melt. Will you shut up, you? Your butter melts too. Don't forget. All right. Well, right. I didn't. I didn't know. Right. So, stop having an opinion. See you in a bit. Goodbye. No, it's cooking, and I said they weren't. Well, there's plenty of juice in there. There's plenty of juice in there. I told you the butter would, uh, would mix into it, but it also says that I add a pinch of parsley. I haven't got any, so I've added mixed herbs. Alright, okay then. What's that for? Put it away. Oh, right, okay then. Alright. See you in a bit. It smells nice already. Does it? Yeah. Right, um, my wife just brought me tea. Uh, she said to me, why don't you have an hour's sleep? And uh, it's not advisable to have an hour's sleep during the day because you feel rough when you wake up. 
Uh, the wind's not now down, but my tea's just arrived, so I'll show you my tea, shall I? If it tastes this, anything like, we've not had it, have we? So when you serve it up, you just pour the garlic and lemon butter, that it's cooked in, you just pour that on your mash. But if it tastes anything like it smells, it'll be gorgeous. I can't taste, can I? No, I, I want a bit for home. Oh, for it for home, yeah. Yeah, so doesn't that look lovely? Um, it does smell I will be honest, gorgeous. I'm having two pieces of chicken, but she's only put one on, so I don't look greedy. And that recipe, I got it off TikTok. Did you? Yeah, I yeah, lot off TikTok, don't you? I picked everything off TikTok. Right, so there you go. So I'm sat in the awning because it's not cold. Sun's out, it's just windy. Sun's out, guns out. Sun's out, guns out, she said. I don't know what that means. Right, see you in a bit. Bye. I'm just going to show you this chicken. How long has that been in slow cooker? Nothing. Oh, how, how long has it been in slow cooker? Uh, what time is it? Look at that, it just breaks up. Lovely that. Nearly four hours. Four hours in the oven, that. In the slow cooker. In the slow cooker. That's how I like. You can't taste. Mm. Why mm. are you doing that, you can't taste? <laughs> I'm joking. No, it's. Um, just breaks up. Just four hours in a slow cooker. Ah, right. thank you, sweetie. She's gone again. What? So I say you've gone again. Thank you, sweetie pie. Oh. See you in a bit. Hi. And then she goes, I suppose it by putting trees on yours. What's that? Broccoli stems. You like trees? Your voice sounds like it's going wrong. Oh, no. All right, then. What do you think? I don't know. It's a bit off. I know you don't like being filmed when you're eating. Is it? Mm. Right. You get the little zest of the lemon. And the, I love garlic in a row. I'd just eat anything with Oh no, that is. It's gorgeous. Right, okay then. So another yeah, try that. It is so easy. Uh -huh. And it's very, very tasty. But don't put no trees on. Alright, see you in a bit, sweetie pie. You see me now, I'm sat busy. Yeah, yeah, see you in a bit, bye. Ah, that was fantastic, that. That's one of the best meals I've had for a long time, sweet pie. Was it? I said, I'll go and take rubbish in the bin, I'll come back and give you a lift. She's already done it up. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, there you go. Anyone, um, nearly time to go and play Dominus. Big shout out to Andrew and Joe. I always get this name wrong. Om Omroyd. Is it Omroyd? Deb? Yeah. They're here, oh, Andrew and Joe. Uh, Errol, big shout out because he came up with this idea for me. And I found two in locker. There you go. Limpets. Put two limpets on there. Stops all that from flapping about, don't it? So, I've not got no more. So, I've kept two for over there. Oh, let me just sit down. Oh. Right, so. The uh, wind scratch thing. I'll have to film that in the morning. Because the weather's not been right. Um, and I haven't got no microfiber cloth. So, I'll need to spare. I think it does have to be microfiber. If the Trojans use micro, my, micro, I can't say it, microfiber, then we've got to use them because we don't get the same finish, Deb. The pe people will say you've, you can't use blue cloth. Can you? Blue roll. Blue yeah. roll. Yeah. Right, so that'll be done in the morning, hopefully. Hopefully, provided the way. There's no point doing anything when it's going dark because you, you need the sun on it. After. Do you need the sun on it if I see the scratches? Uh, I don't know. Have a look. Right, so. I don't know why they made microwaves up there. Did it, I know they didn't make them for little people, did they? No. But. Yeah. Oh, we didn't get the names, did we? Them two scribers today were we'll be on that swift um, rally. No. They've got like a little. little what was it? Oh, because, oh they've got a portable pop puff. So, yeah, because he, he said he can't reach microwave, didn't he? He's little he's like you. He's not Deb. There's not many things shorter than you. But yeah. <laughs> she's, yeah, there is. She's only joking. Martin. Oh yeah, Martin kind of had no yeah, I forgot about him. Yeah, yeah. I feel I feel sick. Actually, tell the truth now. Is Martin shorter than you? Yeah. No, see, I'm asking a serious question, is it? I'm giving you a serious answer. No, I'll give we didn't know that. I don't think he is actually, but he might be about that much. That's his earth. Uh, that's his earth. So when he loses that. Right, okay then. So. <laughs> right, so uh, yeah, that 
fantastic. They've got a swift elegance like us, and uh, so went in there and they showed dead this thing, and she's got bad one. What she's like, she sees something, she buys it. Right, I'm going playing dominoes now with Darren. Uh, he's been. No, in a bit. I've got to go do toilet facilities. Um, yeah, because every, every, every Sunday morning I get up, bob to wee, and there's about that much. Space. Well, it can't be me because I'm not in here all that. But it's when you come back, do you have a bed to wait before mm. you get in bed? Oh, I try, yeah. I wake up at me going that. It's age, Deb. Eh? It's age. Yeah, I know. Look. Right, you see, see in a bit. In a bit. See you in a bit. Morning, Sunday morning. Nearly time to go home. Um, I've checked all the awning this morning. Everything seems to be right. Uh, <coughs> I'm going to make a bit of breakfast for me and my sweetie pie. Um, see, now he's got the camera following. Come on, Tim. Come on, Tim. It won't follow me. No, well, just as you like it. Good, Good, Good morning. There you go. Uh, back in there, we you belong. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm going to make herself some breakfast now, so I'll put the bacon on uh, first. So, only five slices, so three for me, two for Deb. Um, this weekend, it's been all right, hasn't it? Eh? This weekend, it's been okay. Yeah, it's been good. We've had a, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of rain. Wind. Oh, wind. Uh, I'm going to put these eggs on now, which the What's going on with that? It's following you. Hey, I'm here. Uh, Andy General bought us these. He said they're the best eggs you can get. So I'm going to put these on as well. Uh, this here, it might. Oh! Sorry. It might be on next week's vlog. For a simple reason is, we need some sunshine. I don't know if you can see me though. We need some sunshine so we can show you before and after. Uh, put that there. Um, what are we doing this morning? What are you doing now? Making a latte? Yes, you no. no, I don't drink lattes. So I'll get this breakfast cooked for me and my fruity pie. If the sun comes out, I'll show you that. No point coming out tomorrow, we're not here. See you in a bit. Bye. See you in a bit, bye. <coughs> well, you're right, Andy. Them, them eggs do look fabulous, don't they? Do you want a soft egg or want it popping? No, I don't want it popping. Oh, right, okay then. Right, just I'll uh, get these out in a minute. Um, I just want to give a shout out to Mark Atherstone. He's the security guard at Chesterfield. He's been there a long time and he's leaving us in a couple of weeks. So. Thanks for being a good lad, Mark, and uh, we'll miss you sadly. But you know, he's not dying. He's not dying. You know what I mean? He's, he's just going. But that's what I meant. But we got missing. What did you call him? Eh? Where are you going on then? I, well, I might see him. I'm going to work today. <laughs> well, you need me. I'm with that then. Right, I'm going to work. So right, I get these breakfast. Evan sent me a message in the week and says Tony doesn't have to know him in time to put that bob up. It's an habit. Right, I don't know. Right, okay. Right, I'll get this breakfast cooked now. Right, and we'll see you in a bit. Bye. You enjoy that sweet bite? Yeah. Nice, that wasn't it? Yeah. I said I've checked all the awning, <clears throat> but I've took notice on this side here, this was actually there. But the other side, as you can see, is not. And what happens is, it's a moved. I heard a big bang last night, you know. So, you asleep. I'm going, I have to go and get some Jubilee clips. I have no options. They can't go uphill, can they? They can't go uphill. So I'm going to have to put Jubilee clip on. Because we don't want to be away. See, that's supposed to be there. What? That bracket. Ah, uh, sweetie pie, will you do eat pots and let me go and get some Jubilee clips? Oh, are you taking me? I do eat pots all the time. Is that supposed to be flushed out middle, though? Not really. Uh, but... I do pot... When do I get a weekend? Even this one's too far up, though, because Luke is... Right, I'm going. I'm going. I'm busy. I don't get what you mean. I'll show you. I'll go and get some Jubilee clips and I'll show you. See you in a bit. 
I'm not happy. Just been robbed in broad daylight, and I don't like getting robbed. Uh, Jubilee clips. That one, that's all I can do. Stop it from. See? It'll do job, that. That pole won't slide down now. And one on the other side. That won't slide down now. But, they're about 80 pence a piece at the DIY shop. Just paid 8 quid for two. Well, I had to buy the pack. And the guy in the shop said that one oops, will close up to the same size as that one. No one here. So I end up buying two packs. So I've got some spurs, but I don't need them. Eight quid for two Jubilee, Jubilee clips. Right, now I best tension all this back up now, because I've loosened it all again. And then we can get home. See you in a bit. Bye. Right, that's it, everybody. Um, we've had a good weekend. Are we? Hey, sweetie pie. Yeah, I'm just packing. Oh, look at this, by the way. When we said on the video, we've uh, from a couple who we went in the caravan for the Swift Owners Group, they couldn't think of the name. Uh, Deb was having a bit of banter about it. being a short house. Short house like you. And uh, anyway, I, we remember when we got back here after that, sorry, and it's Len and Sue, Brian. So. She's gone again. What's she doing now? There you go. Thumbs up. See, it's not only me, but it does a thumbs up. Too windy outside. Anyway, um, so when she comes back in, we're going to show you. So thanks, Len and Sue Brian, for that. And we'll see you in May, because they're coming to Wipers Northwest. And don't forget, two places left now, because cancellations. Um, come on, Deb. Right, there's a couple of shout outs that's all. We've given a couple. What? Stuck it middle of grass like that. So I don't run over it with a diary. It looks real, it's just stuck it middle of I'll show, grass. I'll show them that in a minute, actually. <laughs> uh, can we do some show things? You do. Me do. Yeah, because I can never read your stupid writing and how you wrote it. So just, just do that. No, I'm a geezer. That's not just on me, right? It's not just on me as well. I'm not sure. We'll let the star of the caravan artist well, then. take it away. Go on. Finish off. Right, okay. And I'm not very good at reading. Um uh, Gillian no wants us to give a shout out to what's that say? I can't say her name. Chloe. Chloe Johnson and Aaron Pimlet. Um she wants to say a massive congratulations on her finishing her nursing degree. Well done. Well done, Chloe. Um well done to Paul Nicholson. Now Paul's not asked for this, I'm just gonna give a shout out. Right, well done to Paul Nicholson on purchasing his first caravan from Stuart Lawton's and he's got a Swiss Sprite 570. Ooh. Very nice. Marty's the guy what looked after him and you can't go wrong with Stuart Lawton's. Their after sales is brilliant. Uh, shout out to Paul and Kate from Weymouth. Uh, and they've just purchased the first skirt from Tent Mountain Services. Uh, well, well done for that. Um, they'll post that, obviously, Weymouth. You're not going to worry about like that, will they? No. My arm's killing me. Um, uh, and that's it, really. Uh, we'll give a few shout outs during the video, won't we? Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, that's it. Oh, I won't give a shout out to Keith, uh, uh, Randall's husband. He always watches, and we never give him a shout out. So, oh. hello, Keith. Thank hello, you, Keith. Hello, we'll see you both in November for the wedding, anyway. Oh, yeah. Right, that's it, so. It's not funny, Deb. Don't just put it on me. My arm's killing me. Why? How come you never all this? Right. So, <laughs> that's what it should be. Yeah, so, that's all right. have a good week. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. <laughs> Cheeky <coin. laughs> Right, so... <laughs> So it's been it's been alright. The weather's been really, really bad. We've got the Jubilee Eclipse on, haven't we? It has been bad this weekend, uh, hasn't it? Try that meal what Deb cooked, because that's one of the best meals I've had. It was really nice. It I, was, I, it I was really good. enjoyed that, nice. yeah. So we're gonna leave it there. Hopefully you'll enjoy the video. The uh window thing, what Dan Trudgeon asked us to try. Asked us to try. We didn't try. It? He, no, he, it? we never met him. <laughs> no, I say mean he to... says he, he's recommended it, so was he recommended it, Deb was straight on Link or whatever she got it from. Off his link, off, off his, his link, yeah. and uh, but the weather's not been nice enough to do it, right? Okay, then, right. Shut up, Tony.
Well, if you haven't. I've, I've just said it. I'll, I'll do it again then because I won't on it. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. Thank you all to the new subscribers too. Yeah, yes, again, isn't it? Mm. We're not just saying it. If you keep if you keep a note of the subscribers, usually on per video, they're averaging 20 subscribers, aren't we? Every week, so we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Two they, all, they all love watching Tony. They all love watching me. All right, fair enough. Right. See you next week. See you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.